don't get punched in the face for thinking I'm just a YouTuber. This what the BMG niggas do. They get big racks, you feel me? You already know BMG got this city hot. And that's a fact. BMG got the city hot. Bow. Don't fuck around. What's good, Stella? Get it. It's your boy, Up Glass, and you are now tuned into the Risk Reaction Channel on the two. You need everyone to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. Today I'm going to be reacting to Chatty G's and Shy EK Smoke em. Right? Like, I'm sure a lot of y'all already know that I'm not really, I'm like, I'm not a fan of this kid, Chatty G's, at all. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I'm not reacting to this shit to gain any th anything from it or nothing like that. It's just, I really, like, people have sent me this shit, my fans, some demand or whatever, right? And I guess more, more than likely, they just want to hear what I got to say about this shit. Not more so his, they don't really care about his song. They want to hear what I got to say about this shit. And they telling me that there's certain shits in there that he said that, you feel me, I need to speak on. So let's get straight into this shit and see what they got to say. Uh, Shy EK, I don't even know. Like, I had this nigga on my live, like, not too long ago and shit. I don't even know why they doing songs with this kid. I don't know if this is a way of them, like, using him as a way to gain some type of clout or popularity or whatever. I don't know what it is that, that to help boost views. I don't know why they did a song with him. <laughs> this shit is crazy. Let's, let's get into it and see what's going on. Oh, fuck the folks, nigga. Smoking on Wooladi, we sent Jude up to Martin Luther, nigga. Yo, bro. Folks, nigga. Smoking on Wooladi, we sent Jude up to Martin Luther, nigga. Yo, bro. This is see the thing that I be talking. Look, it starts off in the beginning of the song, and this way you see that how ignorant certain young black people could be. Like, look at this. They allowed him to say that on the intro and kept it there without a problem. Shot a whole video and everything without that being a problem. Why is this kid who's white, who always saying nigga, gonna say a line like that? We sent him up to Martin Luther. You know, Martin Luther King is, is a black, is one of the black people who actually fought for civil rights and all of that shit, right? For us, right? Why he used that name out of every name he could have used, he used that name, right? So, because the nigga is black, he gonna send him to Martin Luther King, right? So he just said some racist ass shit in the intro, straight off the bat. And and nobody that was in the studio say, yo, yo, what you doing, bro? What, like, what you talking about, nigga, you're bugging. Nobody checked him about that shit. They just let that shit rock. Or it's just that fame and clout and all of that shit means more to niggas than niggas motherfucking morals and values. Because that shit is crazy that they allow this man to say this on the intro. They're going to send him to Martin Luke. So you're going to send him to his ancestor, basic. <laughs> That's like him saying, yo, I'm going to send him to the slaves. Y'all niggas just okay with that shit. That little kids be wildin', boy. Yeah, smoking on Wooladi, we sent Jude up to Martin Luther, nigga. Fuck them niggas. Smoking all your dead eyes, pussy. Man, nigga. Smoking your dead eyes. I said. You got this white kid saying nigga a million times on the intro. D things, mother was sucking on cock. Spin the peas, I'ma send them shots. Seven four, they celebrated by cops, nigga. Suck my dick. Four four, I'm back on my shit. Stop saying I'm a cop. Spin the piece, I'ma send some shots. Or go fuck on Breezo, mom. Bro, you are a cop. But at least we know for a fact that your father's a cop. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I don't even know why he allow you to do this shit. And I don't even know why these niggas allow you to be around them. Like, these niggas be, in, like, the dumbest niggas in the world. Because, you feel what I'm saying? Like, bro, don't be surprised these niggas get indicted. Don't be surprised they get indicted, bro, because they let him actually be around them and chill with them and shit like that. Like, don't be surprised these niggas get indicted, my nigga. Don't, I don't want to hear nothing when y'all, like, real nigga shit, bro. Like, this shit is crazy. Y'all bugging. And I'm not wishing bad on nobody. You know what I mean? Shy EK and none of these niggas out there and shit. I really just think that these niggas shouldn't have him around them. Like, real talk. They shouldn't. 
Come outside, you finna get stomped. Am I a strong? You finna get popped. Mori blick on twirl and drop. Hey, I said Mori blick on twirl and drop. Max the demon, you really a pussy. 45 on me, I'm back on my bully. Baby, look, you like, look at this nigga, look at this nigga, look at this shit. You really a pussy. 45 on me, I'm. Look, that's 45. You really a pussy. 45. Look, he, he fucking retarded. This 45. I me, I'm back on my bully. BB's cane, I'm spinning a hoodie. Fuck a black flag, this blue really moody. He said, I'm ready, this a rape. Big OG said, Sasha, you stay. Little H, just get shiny day. Blinkies know I'm really late. Nick and Nas come inside and play. Come on, I slide Nas on anyway. Glizzy Glow, you can suck my dick. 45 on me, I got a stick. I'm over silent, just like Wick. So, hold on, you telling me, like, real talk, ain't no way that this isn't for Cloud, bro. Because what was the, what's the reason they're even doing this song with this nigga? His verse is super horrible. This shit suck ass. He's offbeat. This shit is whack as shit. Would y'all have did this same track with a with another nigga who didn't have any type of clout or any type of drama behind his name if he had the same exact trash ass verse? Would y'all have did a song with that nigga? Let me know. That's Shai EK. You, you, let me know. You you could DM me directly. Let me know, bro. Don't forget to a snitch. Suck my dick and you fuck with the house. Can't fuck with these niggas, they fuck with the cops. I got some shit that go boom, boom. You see, you say you can't fuck with these niggas, they fuck with the cops. And you got a whole nigga in your video who pops as a. Fuck with the cops, I got some shit that go boom, boom, boom. Man, don't for these shots. Like OG shots. Like OG shots. Don't the cheese, but it's not full dump. Don't the cheese, but it's not full dump. Okay. Shut the fuck up, you little piece of shit. Fuck out of here, stupid ass little nigga. Let I slap your shit out this little fucking piece of shit. Like, I ain't even gonna be racist and say racist slurs back to him and shit after he said that shit. I'm not even gonna do that, because that's corny. It got a lot of it got a lot of Caucasians that watch me and support, and they're not nothing like this piece of shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I really, I can't, I, this is ridiculous. Like, this, this dude really said he's gonna send him to Martin Luther, and they felt like this was, and this song is horrible. Like, I don't even know why they shot a video for this. This song is horrible, but both verses is bad. Like, there's not one good verse on this shit. Both verses is bad. It's a horrible song. You feel me? Like, I get this shit, no cap. I get this shit like a, 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 a 3.5. It's a split. Roll that shit up and bun it. That shit is dirt. Like, that shit is super dirt. That shit is dirt. I don't like this song, not even a little bit. And I'm not only saying that just because Maddie G's. You know what I'm saying? It's just a dirt song, period. Like, anybody else could have had that, spit that same verse as he spit, and I would have said the same shit as dirt. But I felt very offended in the, what he said in the intro and shit. Everybody that is black, or they should, they should feel offended with that shit. He says a lot of racist shit, and he says it right there. He puts it right there for y'all to see it, but it's for some reason y'all just choose to ignore it because y'all, for some reason, want to ex accept his ignorance and, and, and shit like that. Talk about he's funny. It's it's not funny. That's not funny. Y'all just making it okay for him to infiltrate and keep getting niggas locked up and shit. That's that's all he's doing. He couldn't do it with the Brooklyn niggas because the Brooklyn niggas wasn't having that shit. They wasn't going to put his dumb ass and do no music videos and make songs with him. They wasn't going to do that because niggas on different type of timing, you feel me? Especially the niggas who he was trying to act like he was a part of. They wasn't letting him do none of that shit because niggas look at him as a joke. But... Now, you got some younger kids from the Bronx that, I don't know, they just, I guess they, I don't know, man. Word, I, I, don't, even, I don't even know, son. But this shit is 3.5. Y'all comment in the comment section below and let me know if I feel like I read it too high, too low, man. That shit dirt. It's your boy, guys. If you not subscribed to Stella Gang yet, what you waiting for? Come on, join the squad, man. Stella Gang got the city hot. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so you notified every time I drop a new video, man. BMG got the city hot. Y'all niggas know what's going on, man.